How to stabilize a drone video in Adobe After Effects. Ever captured stunning drone footage only to find it slightly shaky? Adobe After Effects offers powerful tools to stabilize your drone videos and achieve smooth cinematic results. Here's a step-by-step -step guide to stabilize your footage effectively. Step one, open Adobe After Effects and create a new project. Go to File, Import, File, or press Ctrl plus I for Windows or Command plus I for Mac to bring in your drone video. Drag the imported footage to the timeline to create a new composition. This step helps you organize your project and ensures that all edits are applied within a consistent framework, making it easier to manage multiple layers and effects. Pro tip, use high resolution footage for better stabilization results. Higher resolution provides more detailed data for After Effects to analyze, which improves motion tracking and results in smoother stabilization especially for complex or fast-moving scenes. Step two, apply the warp stabilizer effect, select your video layer in the timeline. Go to the effects and presets panel and search for warp stabilizer. Drag and drop the warp stabilizer effect onto your video layer. During the analysis phase, After Effects scans your footage frame by frame to track motion and identify areas of instability. The stabilization process will start automatically after Effects will analyze the footage to detect motion and apply stabilization. Step three, adjust warp stabilizer settings. Once the effect is applied, you can fine tune the settings for optimal results. Set this to smooth motion for subtle stabilization or no motion to completely lock the frame. Smoothness, adjust the default value of 50%. Higher values result in smoother footage but may introduce unnatural warping. Start with 10 to 20% for a natural look. Method, choose between subspace warp, position, position, scale, rotation, or perspective based on your footage. Subspace warp is the most advanced but can distort footage in some cases. Step four, preview and refine. Press the space bar to preview your stabilized video. If any areas still appear shaky or distorted, tweak the warp stabilizer settings or trim problematic sections of the footage. Step five, render the stabilized video. Once satisfied with the stabilization, go to composition. Add to render Q or use Control plus M for Windows, Command plus M for Mac. In the render queue, choose your preferred output format and location. Click render to export your stabilized video. Pro tip, use a high quality export format like ProRes or H.264 for the best balance of quality and file size. Give it a try and challenge yourself to stabilize your next drone project. See how these techniques can transform your footage into cinematic masterpieces. Take your drone videography to the next level by mastering these techniques. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful.